Animals that live underwater and breathe air. Air-breathing aquatic animals are animals that spend most of their lives in water, but must come to the surface from time to time to obtain atmospheric air. These animals are diverse in their types and forms, and are found all over the world. Types of Air-Breathing Aquatic Animals Air-breathing aquatic animals are divided into several main types, namely lungfish. These are fish that have lungs in addition to gills. They use their lungs to breathe in air and their gills to breathe in water. Lungfish live in shallow waters where they can easily access the surface of the water. Amphibians. These are animals that live in water and on land. Amphibians have lungs, but they also use their skin for breathing. Amphibians come out of the water to obtain atmospheric air, especially during the breeding season. Waterfowl. These are birds that live in water or near it. Waterfowl have lungs, but they also use the mucous membrane that covers their legs and feet for breathing. Waterfowl come out of the water to obtain atmospheric air, especially during flight. Marine mammals. These are mammals that live in water. Marine mammals have lungs and breathe only atmospheric air. Marine mammals come out of the water to obtain atmospheric air, especially for breathing and mating. Examples of air-breathing aquatic animals. Here are some examples of air-breathing aquatic animals. From lungfish, koi fish, carp. Frogfish, from amphibians, frogs, salamanders, lizards. From waterfowl, ducks, geese, swans. From marine mammals, whales, dolphins, seals. How do air-breathing aquatic animals breathe? The way air-breathing aquatic animals breathe varies depending on the type of animal. For example, lungfish breathe air through an opening in their head called the respiratory opening. Lungfish come out of the water to open this opening and breathe. Amphibians breathe air through their nostrils. Then the air travels to the lungs. Amphibians also use their skin for breathing, where oxygen passes from the air through the skin into the blood. Waterfowl breathe air through their nostrils. Then the air travels to the lungs. Waterfowl also use the mucous membrane that covers their legs and feet for breathing, where oxygen passes from the water through the mucous membrane into the blood. Marine mammals breathe air through their lungs only. Marine mammals come out of the water periodically to breathe, especially during flight. Importance of air breathing. Aquatic animals. Air-breathing aquatic animals play an important role in the ecosystem. They help control the numbers of other animals and contribute to the material cycle. These animals are also an important source of food for humans. Threats facing air-breathing aquatic animals Air-breathing aquatic animals face many threats, the most important of which are overfishing. Many of these animals are caught for their meat or fur. Pollution Pollution pollutes the waters in which these animals live, which affects their health. Climate change. Climate change leads to rising sea levels, which causes the flooding of these animals' habitats. We can protect these animals by reducing overfishing. We can do this by regulating the fishing of these animals and imposing penalties on violators, reducing pollution. We can do this by reducing the use of toxic chemicals and disposing of waste properly. Addressing climate change. We can do this by reducing greenhouse gas emissions and supporting scientific research that is looking for solutions.